fail for me. Uh, Reg, what, what is it about this team overall that holds the Suns to 86 points and under 40% shooting again? We got some dogs over here. Um, this team, we've been grinding out all season. Uh, I'm pretty sure no, nobody got us winning game seven, but we just, you know, we keep our head down. You know what I'm saying? Keep working. We believe in our abilities that we put on both ends of the floor. We believe in the coaching staff. The fans give us a lot of energy at home, um, and we just came out and poured it out tonight. What in particular do you guys have to do to go up there and win game seven? Bring the same energy from the jump. Um, you know, be ready to punch them in the mouth early. Uh, and, you know, just try to just keep that going throughout the game. And, you know, uh, they're a great team. It's a hostile environment uh, up there. But at the same time, we're just going to come with a lot of energy and just play the way we've been playing all year. Reggie, obviously they were kind of trash talking Luca in last game, and, and he says he likes that. But how did you see or what did you sense from him in terms of how he kind of internalizes like the Luca special or the just the jabs he's been hearing from CP and Book this series? I mean, I guess his jabs. I mean, that he's a tough player. He's a great player. And, you know, I, I laugh at it when they try to guard him. You know what I'm saying? But I mean, they want to try to do the same thing him, bring him up in every pick and roll. But, you know, when we get the switch, I know it's a bucket every time. And I don't know about the switches with them to get a bucket every time. But uh, I just know that we're going to back him up. That's our teammate. Um, and he's going to hold us down on the offensive end and give us his best on the defensive end. It's about a team to be able to, you know, take us back and, and not let nobody talk junk to our superstar. <laughs> you mentioned, Reggie, that, you know, people aren't going to be picking to, it to win game seven. A lot of people didn't think you'd get to a game seven, given they're the best record in the league and all that. I had, I had, I had sons in seven. I at least had to get there. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> so don't give me that. Word. But I mean, psychologically, you know, what's the approach there? And I mean, they're the top seed. Is it, is it a situation where you guys kind of feel like you, you can play free and, and pressure's mm -hmm. there? Yeah, definitely. Um, I feel like, you know, we know what we need to bring to this game. Um, we know it's going to be, like I said, a hostile environment. Um, but like I said, it's a little bit more recess time when coach said for us to be able to go out there in Phoenix and, you know, give them another run for their money. And uh, I feel like, you know, we got all the energy behind us right now. And it's just about us just performing that on Sunday. Yeah, Valencia. Oh, sorry. Sorry, Valencia, hang on. You good? All right. Reggie, what's the difference between you guys playing as well as you have here in Dallas, as opposed to executing and as playing as well as you want to play out in Phoenix? The energy out there must be bad or something. Uh, it must be in the air or something like that. But I mean, like we got the best fans here, you know, in the league and they put a lot of energy behind us. Um, obviously all our shooters, we know these rims out here. Uh, we've been shooting here all year. Um, but at the same time, uh, we just got to go out there and just play hard, give it our all, knowing that this could possibly be the last game on the season. And we just got to go ahead and just lay it all out on the line. All right, now we got Valencia. Valencia, go ahead. <laughs> Thank you, Valencia King with Real Talk Sports. Reggie, you mentioned you had a chance to talk with your mom after the last game as well. How much does that family support help you outside of physically getting the chance to work on your game? But I don't know if it means even, even more now that it's during the playoffs as well. Um, it means a lot. Uh, you know what I'm saying? My mom was a, you know, a fighter and a winner our whole life. And, you know, she not going back down from nothing. And I get that from my mom uh, when it comes to basketball. But, you know, it's just a lot of family support. You always got to have that. The, the loved ones is the ones that really matter. Um, and they just give me a lot of energy. I just go out and perform for them. Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it.